Hello, welcome to Emotional Badass, where Moxie meets Mindful. I'm your host, Nikki Eisenhower, life coach and psychotherapist. And on today's episode, I'm sharing a meditation inspired by gusto, Melt Like Butter. So if you're a longtime listener of the show, you know that we think of Gusto, our standard poodle, as the show mascot. And I often teach from a pet's perspective. For so many of us, our pets are the example of unconditional love. In this way, I think pets are better than we are as human beings. It's hard for us to embody an unconditional love for ourselves and for other people. Our pets are gurus of emotional intelligence in this way. Our dogs have a way of being present in a way that we struggle with, especially in this modern society that pulls at us, that expects us to be on top of countless, countless details. So in honor of my sweet, sweet boy, I'm offering this meditation. So let me tell you about Melt Like Butter. This is a thing in my house. So Gusto, he's a standard poodle. He's a big 80-pound ball of fluff. And he's a big goofball. He's a silly goose. And when he does this thing where when we're petting him, he sort of melts into the ground. And I started calling it Melt Like Butter. Butter. So when I'm petting him and he does this thing where just every muscle in his body goes limp and he just slides onto the floor as if he becomes one with the floor, like a puppy with no bones. I started saying this so much to him. Oh, sweet boy. Oh, yeah. Melt like butter. But I said it one day from across the room when he had like a little sleepy puppy face. Those of you who are parents, I know you notice the face of your child and there's a very specific little tired face that we can see. They might fight to stay awake. And he was in that state. And I just said from across the room, hey, Gusto, it's okay to melt like butter. And he did it. He melted. And from that moment on, I realized, oh, he knows this. This is almost a command that I can give. And so he can melt like butter. So that inspired me to write this meditation. Now, I know some of you may not eat butter, so I'm turning the melt like butter into melting like a candle. This is a meditation where we can let go of stress, where we can teach our body to release tension, to be loosey, goosey, and melty. We can let our stress melt away. We can teach this body how to feel easier, softer, And when we engage a meditation like this, it is an act of self-love. It's a practice of self-love and self-care that helps us unravel and release the things that our bodies and our minds hold on to that don't serve us. We can let go. And the more that we practice such letting go and such ease, the easier it is for this body and this mind to embody ease, flow, and peace. This meditation is going to involve visualization. Now, often if I'm working with someone and I offer visualization, I will hear this resistance. Oh, I'm not good at visualizing. Well, this is a great meditation for you. If that's what your critical voice says when I say visualization, it is natural for us to be able to visualize. Some of us, of course, have more of a natural affinity for that than others. But visualization is a powerful tool. And if it's not an easy one for you, I encourage you not to lean away, but rather to lean in. It's a mind muscle that can be strengthened. And the more that you strengthen it, the more that other techniques that I share, that I teach other places, that I talk about and commit to talking about further, this visualization muscle being strengthened in you will help you take care of yourself. So if you will, settle in wherever you are. I suggest being seated 
If seated is uncomfortable for you, standing would work for this meditation very, very well. And remember, in this meditation and all things that I offer, take what works for you and leave the rest. Feel free to morph any suggestion in this meditation into something that works for you. My words are merely a guide, not a rule, an invitation, not a demand, and not a command. So settle into your skin, into this body, and take a deep breath in through the nose and out through the nose. If you're stuffy or if you've been emotional or crying, take in the breath in whatever way the breath can enter the body. Start to notice an easy, gentle rhythm Inhaling with ease and fullness and exhaling with ease and fullness. Inhaling with ease. Exhaling with ease. Notice where the edges of your skin stop and the atmosphere, the air, begins. Notice this boundary. Reach tall through the crown of the head, spine long and tall. Top of the spine reaching upward, tail of the spine reaching downward, extending space between each vertebrae. Begin at the top of the head and scan the body moving downward, looking for and noticing and noting any area of tightness or of tension. Just observing Moving all the way down through the body, down, 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 noticing what you notice about this being, this physical form, and take a deep breath into every cell of the body. On your next inhalation, begin to visualize a candle, one single tall skinny candle. Allow the candle to be whatever color your imagination decided it would be. Allow this candle to sit in the candle holder of your choice, sitting on a simple table, visualizing you and this candle, the only objects in this room. With the power of your thoughts, ignite the candle wick as if you can make fire as easily as you can inhale a breath. Notice this candle outside of you, the fresh, clean, new wick beginning to burn, receiving the flame. I like this idea of becoming one with the candle. 
that as the candle's wax warms and melts, my tension and stress softens, warms, and melts away. As you watch the candle burning, the wax beginning to pool, feel the tension in your scalp begin to melt. Stress, like the wax, melts downward. Gravity sending it down, down and away. Letting go. Melting. Feel the tension in your jaw melt away. Inhaling, finding an easy rhythm with your breath. Exhaling as the stress melts away, down, off the body. As the candle continues to burn, the flame flickering, the wax melting down the sides of the candle as the candle shrinks and shrinks as it melts and melts. All tension in the jaw melts away All tension in the back of the head, the back of the neck, and the tops of the shoulders warms, softens, and melts. With each exhalation, the body feels this delightful meltiness the softening and easing, the tissues, the tendons, softening, letting go, just as the wax slides down the side of the candle, our stress melts away. As the candle gets shorter, we notice any tension or tightness in the chest, in the heart space, and we invite it to melt away. Any pain, any grief, any sadness, any ache or inflammation melts, dissipates, calms, and softens. Exhale and feel the whole body melt. Just like the candle, the body is warm, softening, and letting go. The candle doesn't think. The candle just melts. On 
the next inhale, soften the throat. Let go of any remnants that would like to melt away in the heart. Feel everything melting downward. A profound letting go. A transformation of letting go. Of flowing. Of ease. As the candle melts down, down, smaller and smaller, more wax melting, dripping, pooling, we move to the belly. On an inhalation, we invite the belly to soften. To let go of any tightness, of any tension. To let it melt away. Down, down into the pelvis. Slow and steady breath. Warmth in the pelvis. Warmth melting any tightness. Tension, struggle, weight melting away. As the candle burns, and melts, our stress melts down, down, and away, letting go of any tension in the glutes, moving down the upper thighs, tension and tightness, melting, flowing downward away the candle wick moves through the candle slow methodical consistent We move down the lower body, slow, consistent in our decision to let go of this stress. Allow any tension in the knees to be eased. Melt down through the calves, down through the ankles, down to the feet, and let it all go. Take a full deep breath into the body and let go of any remnants of tension or stress. On the exhale, let go through the mouth, making some sound.
notice the candle. Short little knob. So close to burning itself out. Watch the flame. And know that you can let go of stress and tension. With the same simplicity as we lit this candle. Take two more breaths, gazing through the mind's eye at the flame. Melting downward and downward till there's no more stress to burn. On the next in-breath, allow the idea that you have let go of all of your stress. It has melted away. It is no longer a part of you. From a place of having let go of all the stress, take one more breath and in your mind's eye, blow out the candle. Breathe as I count down opening your eyes when you hear me say one. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two, one. Open your eyes, come back to your space, back to your day. If it feels good to your body, reach your arms overhead. Big giant good morning stretch. And smile. Notice how you feel now in the body and now in the mind. Notice how much power you have to change how this body feels, how it processes, how decisive it can be to decide to hold on and also to decide to let go. Thank you for listening and meditating today with me and with each other. I know all my meditations are a little bit quirky. I'd love to know what you feel about this one how it worked for you. If you want more like this, if you don't,
If you'd like to come participate in some of the discussion, some of the growth that's happening on Patreon, come find us. Immediately, you will be able to download the 40 plus exclusive episodes that we have there for you that you cannot find anywhere else on the internet. I hope there was something in this meditation today that helped you hold yourself, take care of yourself, have healthy escape and mental reset from the umpteen billion things that pull at all of us every single day in modern life. Know that you get an A plus 100 simply if you tried to meditate, if you sat in one spot and tried to internalize my message, my wording, and invited your body and your mind to cooperate, that is an A plus 100. Meditation is something that you get an A in just for trying. Very few things in life are that way. And meditation is one. So remember to give yourself a pat on the back. No critical voice when it comes to meditating. If you want a little more and you'd like the biggest discount we have on everything that we offer, but right now I'm talking about meditation. So on our meditation packs, come join the Patreon. Patreon.com backslash emotional badass. If you do not have disposable income and things are tight for you, I want you to feel like this is something that you are allowed to receive. No guilt. There's abundance in the world. And sometimes we are the ones that give and sometimes we are the ones that receive. To those of you who have the disposable income and make the choice to support us, thank you. It is you and you alone that has kept the show commercial free. Thank you for helping us honor the spirit of the show by supporting us. The show goes out to almost every country in the world. Thank you for being our marketing team. Thank you for sharing episodes. Thank you for helping more and more people realize that they're not crazy, that there's a community of people who are highly sensitive, who are seekers, who are doing their damnedest to heal, to grow, to manage modern life in a grounded, sane responsible way light and love and i will see you right here next time for a brand new episode and a really exciting announcement so tune in to hear that exciting announcement we are growing and i can't wait to tell you how light and love i'm an emotional badass you're an emotional badass and together we are where moxie meets mindful. Bye-bye.